Well, today we got a look inside the new temporary home for lawmakers and their staffers. Their current offices at the state capitol are slated for a major makeover. The nearly 70 year old annex at the capitol is scheduled for demolition and KCRA 3's Lise Mitri is live there with a look at where the legislators will be working. Brian, this is the so-called swing space. It's about a five minute walk from the Capitol. The governor and some lawmakers have already moved their offices into this building and the rest are expected to finish doing the same in the next couple weeks. Boxes are packed and stacked ready for the move. This is a huge project involving the movement of the entire legislature and the governor away from this site to a new location. Assemblyman Ken Cooley is chair of the Joint Rules Committee. It is monumental to figure out how do you keep the legislature functioning as an institution while you tackle deficiencies in this building that were long ago identified by Schwarzenegger. Deficiencies in the nearly 70 year old annex at the California State Capitol like asbestos, old electric and plumbing systems and limited access for people in wheelchairs in the cramped corridors. While a $1.2 billion project to address that gets underway. Conference spaces throughout the building that are provided to folks. This is where lawmakers will be working. Sixth floor. Assemblyman Cooley gave us a tour of the swing space at 10th and O across from the Capitol. This new building was built in 36 months. A temporary home, he says, but temporary may mean for the next four years when construction is projected to last. It's got more open spaces, conference rooms and offices equipped with modern technology and it's energy efficient, he says. This 10 story office building has eight floors for the legislature, has temporary hearing rooms that will serve us for ones that we lose in the annex. Other public hearings and Senate and Assembly floor sessions will still happen at the Capitol, so lawmakers and staffers will have to go back and forth. That does affect probably what people will get done in their day, and that's kind of a bummer. But, you know, it's like, well, you can't get there from here. You, you have to clear out the building. You cannot tackle asbestos in that building if people are in it. The annex construction project has faced opposition, even lawsuits trying to stop it, with some saying it's costly and could destroy Capitol Park. Assemblyman Cooley says the legislature will follow the rule of the courts. Live in Sacramento, Lizay Mitri, KCRA 3 News. So, Lizay, are these new offices going to be open to the public? They will be. If you can see, it is still fenced off right now, uh, so not quite yet. But next month, uh, January 3rd, is when the doors are expected to be open to the public. All right, Lizzie Mitri reporting live for us. Thank you so much.